My bathroom looks like a crime scene now. Blood on the floor and the walls in the loo. Let's hope they never find her body or I'll be a dead woman too. Die, stupid fucks. That pretty much sums it up. Right now, and it's probably due to PMS, but right now I want to fucking well kill everybody and everything. I want to end the world and send everybody screaming into a fire oblivion. Which is pretty fucking scary, even for me. Rage quit! And now it's time for your irregularly scheduled filler drama. Ding dong! I won't be here period that day. I'm going to be out of town with friends all that day. Plus, I've been preoccupied looking for a job. When I get back, I'll let you know. If I feel like it, sure. I mean, we're in a fantasy LARP guild. If I don't come back for a while, it isn't imperative that I give you my reasons. I can come and go from the game as I please, and I don't have to tell anyone why or where I've been. If you don't like it, then you can go ahead and strike my name from the guild registry. It's not a huge deal if you do. Bit hurt much? What's wrong, you mad bro? I'm just a person that doesn't bother with people who want me to do all these little things that are trivial if I don't find them worth doing. I don't deal with anyone's shit, dude, nor do I have any obligations to you as you're practically a stranger to me. Then give me a valid reason as to why I should have to inform you every time I'm not coming by? If you have none, then I really have no good reason to do so. And you can't get mad because I'm blunt and tell you exactly why I don't want to and why I'm not going to. To me. Look, I've got bills and groceries that I need to pay for on a regular basis. And I need to get a job because my dad cannot pay for my shit forever. I am extremely stressed. So I don't need some stupid whiny brat constantly bugging me and telling me to let him know when I'm not going to be available for a LARP. And then get mad when I tell him I won't do that. This is the cutthroat world of adults. This is what happens when you don't have your shit together or when you encounter obstacles. If you don't deal with any of these things, then don't even think of trying to act like you know me or know what it's like to deal with this crap on a daily basis. I am a bitch. I don't care what you think of me. Your opinions do not matter in the slightest to me. You know how sometimes I say that a particular sentence ought to be taken out in short? Well, I'd say that about this, but I'm not even sure that was a sentence. I could use some wine.
her than... Also, if you earnestly think that getting a house at 23 and paying mortgage is easier than paying rent on an apartment, then you're very stupid. Not to mention, a house can be foreclosed if you don't pay your mortgage. <laughs> Hi, I'm her girlfriend, and I was just wondering why you care so hard if she isn't here. Okay, that works. Okay, thanks for sharing. Also, just so you know, it's wildly impractical to tell someone at our age and income level to go for homeowning instead of rent, especially in this state. Jeez, it's not like we're millionaires or anything. No, I didn't say we were close friends. I said we were girlfriends. Lovers. You know. So it just seems kind of strange when random men like you are interested in her life. I just wonder if there's anything that I have to worry about. Okay then, I won't worry my completely good. Thank you.